I'm not going to tell you whether Permanent Record is a good movie. I'm not going to try and convince you to watch it or tell you whether it's politically right on. Just this movie made me feel something and I want to tell you why. At the beginning of the movie we meet a guy called David. He's a senior in high school and it seems like he's got everything going for him. Great friends, talented, got into a good school, and yet he just feels totally empty and hopeless. Not that this is communicated super well, or even that it's the intended reading of his emotional state, but I know that's how he feels. Because I felt the same way when I was a senior in high school. When I started my senior year, I was coming off a high of making art and getting recognition for it. So I decided to switch to my school's independent study program to focus on my art. And that worked at first, but pretty quickly the isolation and my extreme lack of coping skills at the time led to me being just incredibly depressed. I mean, I had a history of mental illness at that point, but this was a pretty long and pretty serious flare-up. But somehow I got it together and applied to college. And I got into my first choice school. But in case anyone thought getting into CalArts would fix your mental problems, it super won't. I was still really depressed. But gradually, things got better. I graduated high school by the skin of my teeth and started putting myself back together. And my life eventually got relatively good. I am so grateful I'm still around to tell you about this. In the context of a video essay series about Keanu Reeves movies. What a life. My story is really not the same as Permanent Record. There are similarities, sure, but obviously things didn't get as bad for me mentally as they do for David. So I don't really know what my point is. I guess just that sometimes we connect to movies we don't expect. This movie has plenty of flaws, but I'll ignore a lot of them just because it feels real to me. Because I've been there. Just before David kills himself, he's at a party. And there's a feeling I recognize in him of being surrounded by people and feeling utterly alone. And I think if a movie can make me feel seen in that way, that's a good movie. And having Keanu Reeves in it doesn't hurt. Don't the best of burn out so bright and so fast Full body 